Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to Ashes to Ashes series 3 episode 4. This means I'm halfway through the final series and I am not happy about it. <laughs> I'm not prepared, I'm not ready, I don't want it to be over. That's the end of that. But I also would like some answers, so you know. I hope you're all doing really well. Just to let you know that the TV show that will be taking over Ashes to Ashes, um, so basically it will run the ep the show that i'm i've chosen will run for a couple of weeks alongside ashes to ashes and then when ashes to ashes stops this show will take over the tuesday slot i don't know if i've said it but the show is merlin which i am very very excited about um it was voted for on a poll on patreon and that was the winner by quite a while um so i'm so 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 excited so i'm i really hope you're happy with the choice there will be another poll soon which will be a public poll and that will choose what replaces stranger things so there is more options coming and the the poll for what's going to replace strange things includes a few older old school shows um a lot of shows that you guys keep recommending me so yeah i i literally don't know which one's gonna win I don't have a clue. I think there'll be a tie between a few of them. So we shall see. Um, okay. Am I going to get answers? Probably not. If you can hear noise in the background, it's peeing it down. And uh, I mean, it's mid-May. What else would we expect? Let's go. I'm not going to get answers, but I'm hoping to get something about Jean. Because it's, it's, it's about Jean, isn't it? Let's go. Oh, I love sassy Jean. I mean, he's sassy all the time, but he's extra sassy at the moment. Why did you put her in there with him? Because I got to hear whispers for the prison floor. When little Danny Stafford gets out, he's going to raise hell. Bring the family back up to where it belongs. A name to be feared. Whispers aren't enough. I needed someone on the inside. Wasn't going to let the Staffords make a fool out of me again. So you put a woman in there, do your dirty work, while you sit on your fat ass twiddling your thumbs. <laughs> If you do catch the bugger, tell him DCI Wilson says hello. Nice tits, by the way. Did he just say? The man's a cripple, Bolly. Have a heart. Heard she had a gun. At least I ran after her. Well, the good like the charge, but yeah. It's okay. She was one of us. Yeah, but what if she hadn't have been? It's a bit risky there, in the line of fire. Don't want something like you care. He loves her so much. I meant as a mate. You belong here. You look like you're visiting, but you're not are you? You stay An excise. Thought you'd have a chat. Didn't realise we had a visit scheduled for today. Or at all. Well, we just need to know if there's anything our department should be aware of. Can't talk here. 
just that you haven't phoned home for a while. Thought it might be nice to catch up, find out what's been going on in your life. Westman Estate, five o'clock. Oh, fuck. Sorry. I wasn't expecting that. Was it our fault? That it happened because we showed up? They were bound to work it out sooner or later. You're avoiding the question. Was it Terry? Where the fuck is it? No. Oh, thank Christ, you're police. For a minute there, I thought I was in trouble. It's a bit early for a drive, Daniel. Where are you off to, church? You see my girlfriend. Spot a morning glory. What, 6 a.m.? Do I have gullible written on my forehead? Here we go again. Oh. <sighs> see, I know you're lying because your lips move, just like an old man. Go. Do you want to see this? What, a little crazy for the girlfriend? Oh. Oh. Was a blue Peter. Mark. Oh. ...into the Blue Peter garden and caused rather a lot of damage. And one oh. really cruel thing they did was to pour fuel oil into the fish pond. Well, we've drained the pond and we've rescued some of the fish, but a few of them have died and the oil itself has caused a lot of damage. And if that wasn't enough, they then smashed our sundial and then callously threw it into the pond. Well, we hope to repair the damage, but it's very sad to think that a few Take such pleasure. It's only a bloody garden. I promise. You promise. Was she in love, actually? The actress. Sorry. Um. I didn't mean to. Um, what can I at least call my mum? Mm, yeah, don't trust her. Don't trust Louise, her. Louise, um, please don't reveal any details about your whereabouts, will you? Something else happened, didn't it? There's, there's no one there. No one there. To protect me, to, to stop him. I mean, you can't blame him, can you? Justice. Assault. Police brutality of the lowest, mm. nastiest kind. It's a tricky one. I expected better from you, Chris. It's natural to feel disillusioned. And that's why I'd like you to join us. The Venture. You don't want someone like me. You're not going to stop until you bring them down, are you? That's what we do, isn't it? I know you might find it strange, but, um... Outside of this... For me, there's nothing. That made me jump. <laughs> So now, now it's being focused on Chris. Rehabilitate him, keep an eye on his progress. No. I swear to God, you better start talking because I've now got the bit between my teeth, my friend. Gov, just think about what Keith is going to say when. It's your last chance. Daniel Stafford. He paid me to look the other way. What? He said he clocked Louise was working undercover. Well, why didn't you get her out of there? It's too late. Well, I've seen some slappers in my time. You take it to a new low. <laughs> Drugs in the van, Sari. Back away, please. My colleague here, she reckons you've got the makings of a good cop. She's got faith in you. Just put the gun down. Listen to Alex, Louise. 
Listen to her. So she is police, but has gone rogue. You cut your own face. What happened, Louise? Broken home, bad family. Don't. This isn't the answer. He isn't the answer. I swear, if you come any closer, Ross. She just swallowed. I just saw her swallow. <laughs> Thank you, Jim. Thank you. Right, you'd like a bloody drink. I know some of the stuff Jean says sometimes like crosses the line, but I just bloody love Jean. I, I would love to know if casting went in knowing they wanted Philip Glenister as Jean or if they just auditioned and he just rocked up because I mean, like who, like who else would even come close? Like try and think of an actor that would come close. Let me know if you could think of anyone else that would play Jean. Because I just, I just think he's absolutely perfect. Um, that focus of the episode was more on Chris. There's definitely this idea of uh, Jim pulling the team apart uh, one by one. We've had it with with each of the members so far. No idea what the relevance with the policeman is. There's the relevance with the stars. Um, those numbers, twenty six or something 2026 20, or something uh i don't i don't know i don't know i don't know it's so annoying the show is so good like it's still consistently good i feel like there's some pressure with the finale of ashes to ashes because the finale of life on mars is probably my favorite finale ever um i feel like i got enough answers and I just don't know how it's going to go down with Ashes to Ashes. Um, but bloody hell, it's so good. I don't have a clue. It's it's about Jean. Uh, it's Jean. And there was a focus on like undercover as well in that one. So I don't know if Jean's... I don't know what he's up to. I don't know. I don't know. Let's leave it there. Thank you so much for joining me. And I shall see you next week for episode five.